Righto, there's another nice brim, as always, with the jelly prawn hooked in the corner of the mouth. We'll get rid of him. So, what I want to basically run through today is where the idea for the jelly prawn came from. Uh, I grew up fishing with my grandfather in Townsville. He, he was a live prawn, prawn advocate. He only ever used live prawns. Uh, and he had a tank under his house that was always full of live prawns. Uh, live prawns, in my opinion, are the best bait going around for pretty much all species of uh, inshore fish. Uh, but really to find a lure that, that looks and acts like a prawn in the water is, is pretty hard to come by. So we actually went out and uh, designed and, and created it ourselves. So whereas most of the prawn lures on the market are simply rigged to swim forwards with a smooth gliding action, uh, we wanted to make one that would actually flick backwards as a fleeing prawn does when something's trying to eat it. So we've turned, away, turned around the way we rigged the prawn. Uh, so now the prawn will hit the water, glide down in amongst the, fleet, in amongst the fish, we can give it a couple of flicks, make that tail kick. As it glides back down, the fish come out and hit it. We also wanted to make sure that the, uh, the eyes really caught the attention of the fish. When we fish with live prawns, we know that as soon as we swing a prawn over out of the water, uh, we look at its eyes and if they're standing up and they're lively, we know, the fish, we know the prawn's in good nick and we can send it back down to the fish. If the prawn's, are lying, if the, if the prawn's eyes are lying down, uh, we simply swing it into the boat, chuck it away. In my opinion, dead prawns aren't much chop at all when we're fishing for the big fish. Uh, so we, we, we wanted to get all of those attributes into the, into the product and we finally got something now that we, uh, we were happy with and we started getting it out there into the community, into the fishing community around Queensland and we're now up to about 23 different species of fish on it. So we're, we're happy we've got a really great product and, and it's catching plenty of fish as we're finding today.